Good morning, everyone. This is Rachel Stevens with Peterson Seed and Services. And I'm out here today in a soybean field that is at the R3 growth stage. And I just wanted to take a minute to talk about uh, foliar feeding and defoliation in soybeans. So as we're out walking through the field, we've been seeing a fair number of Japanese beetles. Um, my last sweep had 15, um, 15 beetles in 10 sweeps. But we have to remember as we're looking at these fields, um, our, our trigger for uh, insecticide is not number of beetles or number of insects, but rather percent defoliation. So when we're looking, we can oftentimes see uh, trifoliates like this um, that has sustained a fair amount of feeding from Japanese beetles. Um, and it's easy to look at that and think, oh my goodness, there's a lot there. We need to go ahead and trigger our application. But we have to remember um, to look at the canopy and the plant as a whole. So what you want to do when you're trying to figure out percent defoliation is pull a trifoliate from the bottom of the plant, uh, the middle of the plant, and the upper part of the canopy. And after you've pulled those three trifoliates, here, if we look at this one, you want to go ahead and get rid of the worst trifoliate. So I'm gonna say that one's the worst. And you wanna get rid of the best trifoliate, which I'm going to say that one's the best. And so that leaves me with an average trifoliate, average leaf on our trifoliate. And so we look at this leaf, and this is probably less than 5% defoliated. So we're going to call that plant 5%. And so we'll want to do this in 10 different plants in the area, pull three trifoliates off of 10 different plants in this area. And then ideally you want to do that in three or four spots in the field. And as you get more accustomed to this, this practice, you can probably uh, cut down on a few of those reps, but initially to really get a good idea of our percent defoliation, it's a good idea to pull several different leaves um, just to really get a good handle on our percent defoliation. So for this field so far, I haven't seen anything above 5%, so we're gonna wait on this for a while. Um, but that's just our, our routine for looking at um, defoliation in soybeans. If you have any more questions about um, insecticide or fungicide application, you can go to our website, petersonseed.com, or follow us on Twitter at petersonseed2, or follow me at Rachel H. Stevens. Thanks.